algebra problems. So what is algebra? Well, at this elementary level, what we're looking at is turning wordy sentences into mathematical sentences with symbols. And these sentences are known as formula or equations. Another way of looking at it is that it's the concept of variables or letters representing numbers. And these letters or variables are unknown numbers and we have to find out what they are. It's rather like a quiz. Let's look at an example. Our English sentence may say, take a number. And so in maths, we will give that number a letter, in this case, Y. We will then be asked to double it. So our math sentence will say y times 2, because to double something is to times it by 2. But since the times or multiply sign is rather like an x, and an x is used a lot in algebra, we will therefore put the 2 in front of the letter, and in this case it will be 2y. Carrying on, we then have to add 3. And so for our math sentence, it will be 2y plus 3. And finally, the result is 15. And so our math sentence will look like 2y plus 3 is 15. So a question that you may get may be along the lines of, if you treble my age and add 4, you have my mother's age of 40. So how old am I? Let's work that through. You treble my age and add 4, you have my mother's age of 40. So, as we have to apply letters for the unknown, in this case we will use the letter Y. So let my age be Y years. And mathematically, we would therefore write it as 3Y plus 4 is 40. Y is the age, and we're trebling that age, which we don't know what it is, and we're adding 4, and we're getting 40. So working through those equations, as we've done before, getting the letters on one side of the equal sign and the numbers on the other, we will start off with 3y plus 4 equals 40, and we will need to take the plus 4 from the left-hand side, from the y terms, over to the 40, and that plus 4 will become minus 4. 3y equals 40 minus 4. Therefore, 3y is 36. Now, we have still have a 3 on the letter side, the y terms, and that's a times 3. And so we have to bring that across to the 36. And y will be 36, in this case, divided by 3. And therefore, our answer will be y equals 12. And since we started off with a wordy English sentence, we will answer it with a wordy English sentence, and therefore I am 12 years old.